Hey guys, Christian from Golby's. Today we're going to talk about Bosch 980 slash 1150cc injectors and what the colours on them mean. So they call them a 980 slash 1150. At 3 bar they flow 980cc, at 4 bar they flow 1150. So to start with, these are an OE injector which are suitable for ethanol fuels. They come as an extended tip because that's what they fit in the OE application. So they're an unmodified injector. So we then take a adapter and make them a three quarter length. So they'll fit into all of the cars we need injectors for. So the colors to start with, a lot of places sell the off the shelf ones as flow matched, which isn't incorrect. Bosch color blue, yellow, and red, depending on what they flow from Bosch. So Bosch flow them at a static rate, which is just 100%. And from what we've worked out at a fairly high pressure. So the blue ones flow the lowest, yellow, middle, and red top. So we've got two blues, two yellows, two reds in our machine currently. From the blue to the red, they should be all within 4%, but the colors between themselves, Bosch get them under 2%. But as you'll see, take note, this is only at static pressure, 100% open. They can still vary between pressures and milliseconds, etc. So what we do for our flow matched ones, we supply them off the shelf like this also, if you want just the color match from Bosch. For the people that want the extra flow matching, we take the one color and we group it into three groups again. So we separate it three times again, depending from the lowest to highest. So I'll empty the tubes. So we'll run these up just at over 100%. And you'll see that these will flow less than these, flow less than these. So this is how Bosch flows them. So we're at 200%, so anything over 100 is open. So as you'll see, the blue ones are less than the yellow, which are less than the red, so 100% what Bosch claim. But what you'll notice on these two blue ones, which are straight out of the box, there is about a 3.5% difference. Bosch claim less than 2%, which yet again is not incorrect. We've figured out if we take base pressure on these two up to about 70 psi, they are within about 1.5% of each other at fully open. But what we're gonna show you is at different RPM and milliseconds, how we flow ours, not just at the one static rate, how different they can be out of the box. So these are all at 100%, but only a fairly low pressure. We increase the pressure back up, we'll find that these two were actually pretty close. So we'll concentrate on these two blue ones and we're gonna go RPM back down to one of the spots where we test our thousands. So we're gonna go about three and a half. We're gonna go 25 seconds and 12 milliseconds. And we'll run these through and see how close they are. So we're testing at 43 PSI. We know with the thousands they flow pretty close at higher pressures, so we want to concentrate on what they flow at operating. So we're currently running at 35% duty, which in a lot of cars will be mid-range and just before or even at peak torque. So a spot that matters for drivability and even for keeping things together. 
So we've noticed at lower duty cycle, they're even further apart than what they were before. So Bosch has done a good thing by colour matching them at fully open, which is a lot more than any other manufacturer does. So you're getting a better, even off the shelf injector. But the point we're making is you can make them even better again by separating them into three groups at multiple operating conditions. Just because an injector flows the same at one condition doesn't mean it will at another. So we could make this 20 different things, but that's getting a bit extreme. So we've picked the different conditions that we've found they vary the most after flowing hundreds at a time. And these are the, the pick of where we found they've been the furthest out. And we know they flow good at high pressure because Boss flow them and color them at high pressure. So we test ours at 43 PSI, which is also where we found they varied the most. So these ones we've got a difference of uh, one, two, three, four, five, around 5%. So in saying that again, for the people that are going to panic and not want to buy our off the shelf ones, 90% of people, it's never going to be a problem. 5% is not going to blow your engine up unless your tune is that close to the limit anyway. Any decent tuner is not going to be tuning your car in those conditions. But if you have an engine that's maybe not efficient on one cylinder, or one cylinder that gets a lot more air from a intake manifold or something like that than others, and you somehow put the lowest one on the cylinder that gets the most air, you could have a 10% difference between fuel and air in a cylinder, which can be getting on the borderline of not happy. So at least you know if you're getting injectors close, that's one thing you don't have to worry about. So for an example, with these blue ones, we would then split them up into three groups. So this would go into our lowest, this would go into our highest. And if we had a middle ground, we're going to be within 2% across all conditions, not just at fully open. So for a set of six injectors, we charge $90, so $15 an injector. Generally, it'll take us so we do a full day, we might get six or eight sets of injectors done. So it takes a fair while matching them at all the different conditions, then putting them back in the machine and testing them all at three as a matched batch all at once. So people that are supplying them as color matched without a sheet is the same as what our off the shelf ones are. But we also offer the extra service for those that want the little bit more security. That's all. Thanks for watching.